Hey friends, so I'm making a special video for Naughty Dawn and for Sue, Sue's Place too. And I have um, Golden Crispy Rings. I'm just going to lay on them because my scoli scoliosis, my back's hurting me. It, it's one something in the morning and it's time to have some breakfast or something to drink and eat again. Um, eight hours ago, so... My clothes are still drying. I've done a couple of um, housework videos. So, yeah. It's just going to wear, you know, you all know me. <laughs> it's just Jenny. So, I'm just wearing my pajamas. And I'm just going to keep working. And um, then I'll just take, a, you know, my medicine and go to sleep. <laughs> but I got a Pepsi for you, Sue. And my water. So this is going to be a drink mukbang. This is this is Jenny Sorcy, you know, me and my drinks, right? The carnation. With, I put cardamom pods and organic cinnamon. So it's nice, fat burning. I got the vitamin D organic milk. I did it in the Vitamix. Carnation in, in, Essentials or Carnation Instant Breakfast. There's a couple different names. But you know what I'm talking about, Melody, right? Um, how does it taste with cardamom? Amazing. I just thought of it, you know, because I like Indian spices and yeah, it's, yeah, it's, it's not, it's not hot or spicy or anything. It's just wonderful. I did a little rant on, uh, you know, we should be able as women to go on, uh, on YouTube and fold our clothes, do our laundry, do our housework you know, feed our cat or dog or whatever without being um, told by anybody else that we're too big or we're too small or we're not good enough because we are good enough. We are all good enough to be on YouTube. I have cheek bones. I'm losing weight. Everybody can see that I'm losing weight. I'm losing inches. I'm feeling good. I don't have any sickness. I'm well, <laughs> you know. I'm, I'm a going video after video hard on the channel and I'm even running Furman's channel. <laughs> Furman's like going and practicing rock climbing now. Things are looking up. Y'all check out his going down the back the back of the uh, the backyard. Pretty amazing that you know my husband what he what he's doing what what he's been through but what he's doing. If you guys kind some of you know what I'm talking about. Others you have no clue. It's okay. I talk in quotes, but I'm going to enjoy this drink mukbang. I'm going to call it a drink mukbang. Okay, some of my favorite drinks. I'm just going to breathe and just kind of relax my spine because it does hurt. I did took my, I took my turmeric earlier, but that was hours ago. And yeah, I might have to take a pain pill tonight <laughs> to sleep. But you know, so... I have these men say, a couple of men, what, one is like obsessed with big women, wanting them to look, you know, loves watching big women videos, likes those videos. And then one keeps saying, do you like being so big or something about my weight? Want to know my weight? I was like horrified. You don't ask a woman their weight. Anyway, I had to answer. But anyway, I'm um, on track. Still doing your, um, I'm doing uh, Eddie's songs. I listen to a couple of his songs. I'm still dancing. I'm still doing um, housework and cleaning. And I have been doing like wiping the counters after I do these mukbangs. I've been putting Eddie's music on and Blue Hawaii and Elvis. And I try to always leave a comment, but I'm not like always perfect with that. It's hard. And I always watch your, your videos, Melody couple of them made me cry or I play it again yeah whew. they're whew, a little a lot it was a lot to take in and I just feel awful that you felt feel so bad of the way you're treated with these these comments that people give you you know I get one comment and I'm like I'm gonna address this right now oh uh, dude you know what does a 20 or 30 year old man know about the struggles of weight loss or or weight gain. How about the women that can't gain weight? How about the ones that are dying of diseases that can't gain? 
like, don't let these comments, you know, and I, and I did say I will disable comments or just take them off or unlist my stuff if I have to keep seeing this crap, you know. I don't want my friends Melody or Sue or Eddie or any of my friends have to see me being bashed and abused. <laughs> I don't even want my haters to see me being bashed and abused. I don't deserve it. I am not that big, you know. <laughs> yeah, so strange. There's so many people bigger than me. They can go concentrate on the way bigger people. There's 600 pound people on YouTube making videos. Don't pick on me, that's a third of the weight, okay? Give me a break. And I work so hard. <laughs> I work so hard. You know, thyroid therapy takes six to eight weeks to kick in. Day two or three, don't discourage me, you know? So, I'll protect you, my friends, from these fake people that pretend to be your friend, but they just want to make you feel like shit. <laughs> I'm gonna say, I'm gonna tell it how it is. They just want to make you feel like shit about yourself. What do they know about being a woman if they're a man? You know? <laughs> so, anyway, I got that off my chest. <laughs> like, I'll address these things, I won't hide. I'm sure that if any, any of my hater women would just be flabbergasted if any 20 or 30 year old man asked them their weight and their height and their weight and they like being big when they've said in their videos a thousand times they hate being they hate being well they said they hated being big or they call themselves I'm so so fat and I don't do that uh, not really I say you know I have some fat I have some fat on the side of my breasts and you just push them in, so what? And then I have some fat on right here on my sides. Those are that's the first to go. But when I lose weight, I lose weight in my legs and the swelling and the fluid build up. And then, you know, I lose weight differently. Everyone loses weight differently, you know. <laughs> so I'm sorry whoever makes those comments, but I have like 17 videos going up, so if you're going to write it on every video, I'm just going to disable my comments. Because I've made a lot of friends with Indian people, and they have good secrets on weight loss. And I follow a lot of the Garson. Yeah, I follow a lot of it. I study in Indian medicine. I study Chinese herbal medicine. I study the way the Japanese, they do the uh, coral calcium. I've studied it my whole life. You know, I know what I'm talking about. I know what I'm doing. You know, I'm at the end of menopause or it's over. So nothing is stopping me. Not one thing. <laughs> you know. Why I make belly videos and why I make stuff? Because I love massage. I don't have the money to hire a massage therapist for every single day. I massage myself. I wash myself. This is the care I give myself, you know. <laughs> well, uh putting lotion on my arms um, doesn't mean I like being big. That means I like having soft skin. You know, people get things twisted. You know, if you see in my videos, I'm doing Sriracha. I'm doing Cayenne. I've been hitting it hard with the fenugreek and thyme to prevent bronchial infections and sinusitis. You know, I've been hitting the basil really hard. I got basil for my soup. I've been picking basil. I've been hitting the parsley hard. And you know what? If it's not good enough for somebody, then they need to be gone out of my life. <laughs> How about that? How about that? Because I can't even get them to eat one vegetable in two years. Not one. Not one single vegetable. Not one single... Uh, well, some of my friends don't like tomatoes. I do. But I can't get them to even eat one single orange. Maybe a banana. I can't get them to get off coffee. Um, a little bit off. Sometimes they have water propel. I can't get them um, to stop talking about why they like tea and they hate coffee. I've got all these weird 
things that go on YouTube with these repetitive, like, computer chip, you know, monsters. They're just broken people, you know. I try to slap some sense into them, you know. Even if they watch one minute of my video, I try to slap some sense into them, you know. Try coffee. Uh, if you had a bad childhood experience when you were 9 or 10, try it when you're older. It's awesome stuff. They have weight loss coffee, but don't drink it. Don't drink eight cups a day, you know. And then I got the other person that's just the extreme, you know. And it's just like with my Coca-Cola addiction. I'm having Diet Pepsi today for Sue. But, you know, I, I usually drink three, uh, diet, uh, three Coke Zeros. So I've been cutting it back to one or one little can. It's so tiny. Yeah, and it's hard. You get headaches. If I don't have it, I have horrible headaches. Stay away from me. Yes, I need it. <laughs> it is an addiction. Yeah. I've never denied it. I've always thought, you know, I've always admitted it, you know. But, uh, yeah. But this uh, this feels good on my back. But I'm going to keep doing the awesome foods. We've got a homemade zucchini. And, uh, we got zucchini and cucumbers. I'm going to keep doing the round cucumbers with a little bit of Himalayan salt. That helps my cramps on my legs. And, uh, yeah. You know, if you try really hard and you notice that someone doesn't ever eat any fruits and vegetables ever, they just eat bread, they just eat sandwiches with a few pickles in it, meat, cheese, maybe a handful of, of iceberg lettuce, they never eat spinach salads or plums or, you know, great big pieces of watermelon or corn. They think corn is bad. I mean, they're warped and there's something wrong with them. So then you move on, <laughs> you know, it's like this person does not have nutritional information, hasn't made me take a course, <laughs> but I can't follow people like that. I am too busy trying to work with my herbs, trying to work with my uh, nutrition, trying to clean up the house. As you know, having a big house, there's a lot of cleanup involved tidying up, spraying things down, and laundry, right? <laughs> and uh, it is a lot of work. I, you know, um, I really love June Marie and Liddy's videos. And when I first started watching her videos, she reminds me of like a thin version of me, like when I was really young. And uh, so vivacious. She just wants everyone to be happy and healthy, and I do too. You know, I have a little bit of weight on me, but uh, I don't compare myself to anyone or to her. I love her the way she is. She's awesome. You know, we have to love each other the way they, you know, the way each other, how we are. You know, now there's just some people that are toxic that won't listen to reason, and they've got like mind control, and like it's like they're chipped. And they're like, cuckoo, They talk about the same things over and over, you know, like, oh, I wish I had a job. You all know who I'm talking. You know, oh, I wish I did this. Well, why don't you get off your ass and plant a garden or do a try on or, you know, go help, go help, uh, go help your friend, go get friends, go help people, <laughs> you know, so, you know. The cuckoo-ness, I can't keep listening to. I hate repetitive stuff. So, yeah, I have to move forward. <laughs> but, yeah. If they're saying the same thing one year later, there's something mentally wrong with them. And that's okay. That's okay. I invite every, everyone. They have mental problems. They want to see my videos. I invite everyone. But they, you can't leave comments you can't leave fat comments on my channel. No fat comments. I made that boundary before. I don't want to hear fat comments on my channel. 